Hello guys, and today I will show you how to connect your Sonos Era 100 to the Sonos application. Let's get started, but don't forget to follow to see more useful content. So firstly, we need to restart our device. If you don't know how to do it, you can check out the video in our channel, and the link will be right here in the right corner. After you restarted your device, you need to download and open the Sonos application. Right here, you need to click on the speaker or component. After this, the Sonos application wants us to log in into their system. You just need to click continue and follow the instructions on the screen. Now, after we successfully logged in, we need to give the Sonos application permission to use Bluetooth, your location and access to the network. We need to click on continue, allow, continue, allow while using app and continue, allow. After this, the application asks us if we want to turn on the notifications. If these notifications, you can see new system features, product releases, offers and promotions. But if you don't want to see these notifications on your phone, you just click continue and don't allow. After this, the application will start looking for your device. After it finds, we need to just click on add, continue and allow. And after this, you would just need to follow simple instructions on your screen. And now, after we are done with the instructions, we finally added our device to the Sonos application. Now, we are on a home page and you can see tab named your services. If we click on this plus, you can see that right here you can add your favorite services for music listening and control them right into this application. You just need to find your favorite service, log in and everything's done. Now we go back on the home page and we need to find this icon settings right here. We click on it and we click on the name of our device. Right here you can find a lot of settings to customize the sound on your speaker and make your experience with your device even better. And also on this application you can set up a voice control to control your device without touching it or touching your phone. To find it we just need to go a little bit lower and find the tab named voice. And here's the button to add a voice assistant. Also you can set up assistance as Amazon Alexa or Google Assistant. And that was all for today. I hope this video was helpful for you. Thank you for watching.